So I made this dry pollen feeder about a week ago or so and I was worried that the bees weren't going to find it even though they're just right there. And I come out here today, it's 56 degrees right now, and I see this wonderful sight. Bees in there, and you see her just tumbling all over the place. Bees in there collecting pollen like crazy. Not as many as what I was hoping there'd be, but maybe they have just finally found it and are really starting to get into it. Um, back where, where that bee just landed at, where like that glob of pollen is, that actually got wet because I had this, um, I had this level and for this to really work so no rain gets in it, it needs to be tilted. I can't tell if that shows up that well, but yeah, it does look tilted. It, it's not tilted that much, um, but it doesn't really need to be tilted that much to begin with. Just, just enough to where if any rain comes in, it collects down here. So that way the bees can fly in, go get the dry pollen, and most of the pollen stays dry. Um, when I had it completely level, it had rained quite a bit, and I guess this pollen right here got wet, and then it just flowed downwards when I tilted it back but I am extremely happy to see this so this little pine tree came in handy it used to be about uh, about this tall a um, year and a half ago or so and I decided to let it grow maybe give some shade to my bees and that's how much it's grown in, in a year and a half. And it has a nice little handy uh, branch system here to support this this uh, pollen feeder. And I have a feeling I've said pollen trap a couple times. I did not mean that. This is a dry pollen feeder. It's very simple to make. It's four inch drain or sewage PVC pipe. You want that as the uh, sidewalls on it are very, very thin. As you can tell from that, the uh, PVC glue, cement, that blue area right there, this is very, very thin sidewalls. If you get regular Schedule 40 PVC pipe, it will not work because this type of end cap, it's for uh, drains and it will not fit over regular Schedule 40 PVC pipe. And then on the other side of the end, just have a flat PVC cap. You cement those two end pieces together on there to make it watertight. And then find a place to hang it up. Tilt it just a little bit so water doesn't go in and uh, get your pollen all wet like this happened right here. And then your bees will find it and they will be able to supply your hives with pollen. When you first put it in I had got a really good suggestion from a guy on Instagram. I believe he is at just B N C. He told me to put some honey down at the entrance. So I got some honey, my honey, and smeared it around the entrance. And within an hour, the bees had found this. But then we got hit by some really, really cold days. And they haven't really been able to go out and find this again. So that honey all dried up because they ate it all up. They didn't really seem interested in getting the pollen that day. Um, and as you can see now, they are interested in getting pollen. And I should probably back away from here so that girls can keep on doing their jobs. Well, y'all have a Merry Christmas, everybody. Happy Holidays.